I'm good. How are you doing? Great. Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah, I'm going to be dancing. This is this is my dancing outfit. This shirt, I can move. Like, I can do, like, some pop and lock moves. And then I got, yeah, the nice Jordans on. But ask all my friends, like, if there's music, I'm dancing. I don't need a drink to get me to dance. No, no, no. No, no, no. I don't drink. What music do you like to dance to? What music do I like to dance to? Um, I'm really big on uh, on hip hop. Uh, you know, Chris Brown, even though as a person, maybe not the best guy, his music is really catchy to dance to. Uh, the EDM craze, I'm kind of like getting into that a little more. Uh, but mostly mostly hip hop. Like I've taken some, some hip hop classes here and there and uh, yeah. So do you have like a signature move that you like to do? A signature move? Uh, I've tried this before. I don't know if it works very well, but it's like, uh, it's supposed to be an illusion. So it's like, I like to do that. And people are like, oh, white boy with moves. And it's like, that's kind of like a party starter or like a little bit of the doggy, you know? Like all those like, what would I call that one? Um, the, the head elevator. Yeah, the, the head elevator. And it also sounds cool, like the head elevator. Like I just saw a preview for uh, for the latest uh, Step Up movie, and there's always that big dance battle, so I feel like someone should just like off screen be like, and now comes the head elevator. And then it's like, battle over. You need to trademark that. I'm going to, thank you. I will, I will. Do you have a, what's your signature move? Everyone's a dancer. Can you move like on on a beat? Then you're a dancer. Oh. I need to catch my breath. I'm gonna slow dance with him today. Yeah. That's what you guys are gonna do. Yeah, we're gonna slow dance. And we're gonna... Who's gonna lead? I don't know, maybe me. I think I'm gonna lead. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Maybe he'll let me. You guys can take turns. We could take turns. I'm not, I'm actually not a good uh, follower, so. so. You like to be a leader. I like to be a leader, yeah. I'm a Scorpio, I feel like it's in our blood. Yes, yes. Scorpio, yes, yes. I'm a Capricorn, Scorpios and Capricorns go well together. What, do you know uh, what the dates are for that? So, yeah, I wanna say my dad is a Capricorn. Yeah, my dad's Capricorn, yeah. So, I mean, I get along with my dad, we would totally get along. Yeah. That's good, that's good. I love astrology. I love meeting, like, compatible signs. And then when they're incompatible, you know. Like, it's weird, it's weird. You can kind of, you can be like, I don't like that person because we are not astrologically compatible. You know who the crazy signs are? Like, don't mess with a Leo. Or Aquarius. Yeah, yeah. I dated a Leo once, and yeah, never again. No, or Gemini. Split personalities. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. But Leo, Leo is defiant as anything. Very stubborn. Very stubborn. Yeah. It was. It was a fun relationship. I enjoyed it. It was cool. Yeah. You're glad it's over. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely glad it's over. I need to meet like a compatible sign. No more Leos. Yeah. I will. This is cool. This is a fun conversation. I enjoyed it. Well, do you have anything else going on that you want to tell us about? Uh, I'm, uh, I'm getting ready to do a movie that uh, one of my best friends, Jordan Ross, wrote, who is standing over there. You should pan to him, so we should talk about him right now. So the guy that's on his phone constantly just wrote a movie called Bethlehem, and uh, yeah. And uh, so we're, we're getting ready to go to uh, Bethlehem, Pennsylvania for a few weeks. Uh, I want to say June or July. And it's a movie about um, uh, overcoming your obstacles when you're in a small town and like really not letting that stop you from living your dream. So it's, uh, it's about football and Devin is the lead guy and I would play his best friend and we're just all gung-ho about like getting out of this town because it's sucking our lives dry. And uh, it's a total under, underdog story that I think people are going to really enjoy. So are you playing football in the movie? I think so. 
I, I think I am, in which case I'm definitely going to need to like work out a little bit because, yeah, yeah it's uh, like I've, I've had football pads on before and they're heavy. It's very heavy. And then you add the helmet and your head is doing like this. Got to work the shoulders. And, uh, or, or, you know, it's like we'll do movie magic where I just look like a football player. Or maybe I'll just say like, oh, my character is not really, he wouldn't be good in football. It's an actor choice. And we'll see what he says about that. But I do want to work out and play football, which is what I think it's going to be mostly. It's going to be like just having fun with your friends, making a movie. That's what life's about. Awesome. Well, good luck with everything. And I hope you have fun tonight. Show him the head elevator move. I will. Don't let anybody steal it from you. I will. It's going to come probably towards the end of the night. You know, I don't want to give, a, give it away too soon because then I have nowhere to go from there. So, yeah, so stick around till like 8 o'clock. Maybe the closing, yeah, maybe the closing dance, that's when it'll be whipped out. Yeah. Go out there and show up. Yeah, I will. Awesome, it was good talking to you. You too, as well. <laughs>